and wicked men, for all men have not faith. And it's uh, proven by Eddie Long own testimony. Now this uh, 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 man been uh, sodomizing uh, 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 young boys. And I, I believe he have over uh, 30 accusers. Uh, uh, now, now you is a, a, a wicked, a wicked devil in Jesus' name. Yeah. You you uh, 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 call a brother in the church, you know. No saved person uh, uh, have any business uh, 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 having a homosexual and last relationship from the beginning. And then you're going to take little young boys, uh, 17 years old, and try to sodomize them. Well, see, the, the adversary is, uh, he's clever. You know, you want to try to sodomize them and, and, and give them that wicked spirit so they can go on uh, uh, sodomizing other people. But I thank God for True Light Rebuke that right now. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Verse 6, it says, now we command you. This is not no option, uh, I believe, what New Birth Baptist Church. This is a commandment by God. Yeah. Now we command you, brother, in the name of our Lord Jesus Christ, that you withdraw yourself from every brother that walketh disorderly and not after the traditions which he have received of us. Now this is a commandment, New Birth, that y'all have to withdraw yourself from Eddie Long. Yeah. He ain't no, no, this is not, you know, he's uh, 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 wicked. And then you got uh, 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 other Jack Led preachers like uh, T.D. Jakes uh, 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 criticizing uh, patriarchs of the Bible, talking about David was a homosexual. Naomi and Ray, uh, Ruth had a home, uh, a lesbian relationship. We rebuke that in Jesus' name. The Bible says uh, David was a man after God's own heart. So how are you going to try to uh, 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 say David was a homosexual? And how are you going to say uh, uh, Naomi, uh, uh, a woman after God's own heart, really? Because uh, uh, she uh, taught Ruth, uh, and the Bible said Ruth. Or brought forth the seed of Jesus. How are you going to critique? <laughs> well, I thank God once again for true life because we're going to point y'all devils out. And we're not only going to point y'all out, baby. We're going to sit down and we're going to come to your church. You better watch out because we might come to Atlanta. Uh, and your person <laughs> And uh, let me kind of just uh, mention what the governor touched on. Amen. We'll be peacefully protesting at New Birth uh, Church. That's the church of uh, uh, Eddie Long, his branch in uh, Charlotte, North Carolina. Hunterville is the actual, I think it's the suburb of Charlotte. Amen. Hunterville, North Carolina. Uh, the address is 1700 New Birth Drive. Hunterville, uh, a sober with Charlotte, North Carolina. We'll be there Tuesday, October the 5th at 6.30 in a peaceful protest to demand that not only that uh, uh, Eddie Long resigns, but that people, we question the character yes. of the people who will follow us. Amen. Amen. Praise the Lord, July. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord, July. Amen. Christ, who is my life, amen. All honor to our great apostle, Bishop H. Walker, Black Lady Mother of America. And to where honor to what honor is due, we thank God for this great panel coming against the falseness of the false prophet, amen, and against anyone who supports the sodomite and lesbian coalition. And I want to start off in the book of 2 Thessalonians 3 and 2, and that we may be delivered from unreasonable and wicked men, for all men have not faith. Amen. All men don't follow the doctrine of God's word. And I want to tell you in the book of Ephesians, the sixth chapter, right from verse four. And ye fathers, provoke not your children to wrath, but bring them up in the nurture and admonition of the Lord. Eddie Long. It says, provoke not your children. You're supposed to be a father to them. Amen. Right. Not a faggot, amen. You're supposed to be a father to them, amen. All right. and, 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 and let me say, oh, you can't come against us, amen. No, we're not, we don't apologize for what we say, amen. You can't come against us and, and, and take our Bentleys 
And our jacks, amen, we don't have that kind of money, amen. Oh. She's not going to back down, amen. Y'all y'all make some Holloway back down. I was here watching, but you ain't going to back down, amen. <laughs> Abolition of the Lord. Show how to be a man, a father, not to be a sissy, amen. All right. The sodomized young man, it says, the admonition of the Lord. Right. Sodomy is an abomination yes. unto God, amen. Yes. All right. And yet you say, you're going to fight it. You got five stones. Uh -huh. Well, they're not smooth stones. They're the stones of David, amen. You got five stones of Satan right. in Jesus' name. Yeah. Amen. <laughs> Why are we so, and they say, well, you like, you, 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 y'all hate. Y'all hate lesbians. You hate the gays. No, we hate a sin that is destroying the family unit. Now you got a, a coalition of parents and family and friends who support the lesbians and homosexuals. Where if the parents support them, amen, where is the family unit coming from 10 years from now? Where is the babies coming from 10 years from now, amen? Well, what would be the marriage 10 years from now? It won't be a marriage. Marriage be obsolete. And you people who commit abortions, Thank God for my six baby on the way. Hallelujah. You say it's your choice. Oh, the woman's choice. No, it's not your choice, amen. When you go and get that ultrasound and see that baby moving in the womb, moving around, the little nose, the little fingers, amen, and all the heartbeat, and you're going, well, I'm getting rid of it because, you know, he don't want no more. And plus, you know, I already got four, amen, and if I have another one, I'll be ostracized by society. We rebuke society. Amen. Oh, we rebuke anything that comes against the family unit. If you got one hand of sodomites, one hand you come to babies, there won't be any babies. Oh, and ten years from now. But we thank God for a standard and true life. We're not back now, amen. We're gonna follow our A loan. Jimmy Jackson. Anyone who does not follow the prophet, and you false prophets, you better line up first, repent. You better get in line and better follow a true prophet yes. and take on humility that you might find rest for your souls. Amen. 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 Praise the Lord to give true light. Praise, Praise Jesus, true light. Oh, hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Glad to be here today. Yes. Amen. In the house of God, which is supposed to be the house of the living God, the pillar and the ground of the truth. Yes. Hallelujah. But nowadays, the false prophets have made it a den of thieves. Yes. They continue to sell tapes and whatnot in the house of God, which is supposed to be holy. Amen. So I'm glad to be here today, and I give honor, of course, amen, to you. I give honor, of course, to Jesus Christ, who is my Father. Amen. I give uh, double honor to our leader, Prophet H. Walker, a true man of God, standing up in his dispensation with the message to the people if they would just humble themselves and listen. Amen. And I give honor to all my brothers and sisters uh, in the body of Christ today. I greet you in that precious name of Jesus. Yes. Amen. And it was very interesting. Uh, of course, I've been looking at the news and seeing everything, but it, it really doesn't surprise me. Because the Bible talks about these things are going to happen anyway. It talks about certain men who have crept in unawares. So since we watch, we're, we're not caught unawares. We know Jesus is coming back as a thief to them who don't watch. Amen. But we, we're watching. We're prayed up. Amen. In the book of 1 Corinthians, I want to pick up somewhere in uh, 1 Corinthians chapter 11, uh, verse 19. It's very interesting that... Our leader, Prophet H. Walker, he brought this out. And it says, uh, For there must also be heresies. In other words, there must also be false teachings among you, that they which are approved may be made manifest among you. In other words, people who claim to be a part of, uh, of the body of Christ, if they don't line up with the doctrine of the apostles, and come with another doctrine, that's a heresy. Yes. That's a heresy. Amen. But this, these things have to come about. There has to be a, a, a so-called prosperity doctrine. Uh, what was brought out about Tim Carlton with the, his gospel, where he, the gospel of in, inclusion, or whatever you want to call it. In other words, there has to be these, these heresies. These are all heresies. Yes. Yes. Amen. But we're grounded. We know the truth. 
Yeah. They can't fool us. Yeah. The Bible said this study 